Welcome to the Kuji Tunnels, where underground adventure meets guerrilla warfare. Prepare to be amazed as we delve into this subterranean labyrinth of surprises and clever tricks. Before we continue, please smash that subscribe button, press like and drop us a comment. Your engagement really helped to grow the small channel like us. Picture this. A network of tunnels snaking beneath the lush Vietnamese countryside, hiding an entire city underground. But wait, it's not your average city. It's a city built for survival, resilience, and, dare I say, some mischievous surprises. The Ku Ji tunnels were the ultimate guerrilla hideout during the Vietnam War. They were like the secret headquarters of the Viet Cong, a bunch of sneaky rebels who knew a thing or two about staying one step ahead of their enemies. And they did it all while keeping their cool underground. The construction of the Ku Ji tunnels spanned several years, with the initial groundwork beginning in the late 1940s during the resistance against French colonial forces. However, it wasn't until the Vietnam War escalated in the 1960s that the tunnels truly came into their own as a strategic stronghold for the Viet Cong. These tunnels weren't your run-of-the-mill underground passageways. Oh no, they were engineering marvels. The Viet Cong dug these tunnels by hand, armed with nothing but their trusty shovels and a can-do attitude. They were like the world's most intense DIY project. Except instead of a new bookshelf, they were building a strategic military stronghold. At its peak during the Vietnam War, the network of tunnels in the Ku Ji district linked VC support bases over a distance of some 250 kilometers, or more than 155 miles, from the outskirts of Saigon all the way to the Cambodian border. The journey began with the vision of creating an underground network that would serve as a sanctuary and a lifeline for the resistance fighters. This painstaking process required a tremendous amount of physical labor, as the Viet Cong soldiers and local villagers worked tirelessly to excavate the soil and create the underground passageways. As the tunnel system expanded, so did the complexity of its design. The Viet Cong employed their knowledge of the local terrain and geography to strategically plan the tunnels. They utilized natural features like rivers, swamps, and dense vegetation to conceal the entrances and confuse the enemy. The Viet Cong ingeniously constructed multiple layers within the tunnels to maximize their effectiveness. These layers included living quarters, storage rooms, kitchens, hospitals, and even command centers. The tunnels were divided into sections, each with its own specific purpose, creating a well-organized and functional underground city. Building the tunnels was not without its challenges. The Vietnamese climate added another dimension of difficulty, as the heat, humidity, and rain made the excavation process even more arduous. Additionally, the constant threat of discovery by American and South Vietnamese forces heightened the need for secrecy and caution during the construction. To counteract this threat, the Viet Cong employed camouflage techniques to conceal the tunnel entrances. They cleverly disguised them as termite mounds, woodpiles, or hidden trapdoors, ensuring that the enemy would have a difficult time pinpointing their locations. This level of deception added to the overall complexity of the tunnel system and contributed to its success as a hidden stronghold. The construction of the Ku Ji tunnels was a collaborative effort, involving not only the Viet Cong soldiers but also local villagers who provided support and labor. They worked tirelessly, day and night, to excavate the tunnels, transport supplies, and reinforce the walls. Their collective determination and spirit of resistance fueled the progress of the tunnel construction. Imagine navigating a dark, narrow passageway, the earth pressing in on all sides, with only the faintest light piercing through the cracks. 
It's like being in a real-life game of hide-and-seek, where the seeker has an intricate network of secret passages at their disposal. It's a cat-and-mouse chase where the mice have the upper hand. Imagine the Viet Cong warriors, like a band of tunnel-dwelling superheroes, living their daily lives deep beneath the Earth's surface. The real marvel of the Kuji tunnels lies in the resourcefulness of its inhabitants. The Viet Cong had kitchens where they cooked meals, workshops where they repaired weapons, and even schools where they educated their children. It was like an entire ecosystem thriving beneath the surface. Now, let's talk about the ingenious tricks and booby traps that awaited any unwelcome guests who dared to venture into these tunnels. The Viet Cong were the ultimate pranksters, turning defense into an art form. From trapdoors that would make Houdini proud to hidden pits filled with spikes, they had a surprise for anyone who thought they could waltz into their underground hideout without a hitch. But the Kuji tunnels weren't just about defense. They were a lifeline for the Viet Cong, providing supply routes, communication lines, and a way to strike fear into the hearts of their enemies. Imagine being an American soldier, thinking you had the upper hand, only to realize your opponent had vanished into thin air, leaving you scratching your head and wondering, where did they go? Visiting the Kuji tunnels today is like stepping into a real-life action movie. You get to crawl through the narrow passages, feel the humidity, and experience a tiny taste of what life was like for the Viet Cong. It's a thrilling and immersive journey that will leave you in awe of the human spirit and the lengths people will go to defend their cause. In summary, the Ku Ji tunnels were instrumental in the Vietnamese victory during the war. They provided the Viet Cong with strategic advantages, including mobility, communication, protection, and intelligence gathering. These factors contributed to their ability to outmaneuver, outlast, and ultimately defeat the superior firepower of the American and South Vietnamese forces. The Ku Ji tunnels stand as a testament to the resourcefulness and resilience of the Vietnamese people in their fight for independence and reunification. So, strap on your adventure boots and get ready to go underground. The Kuji tunnels are waiting to show you a world where mischief and survival blend seamlessly. It's like a game of hide and seek, but on a whole new level. Just remember to watch your step and keep an eye out for any surprises lurking around the corner. Happy tunneling!